Hey guys, this is Ping and Hilt, and I just got my, what is it, September now? September, uh, Play by Sephora box, and I'm going to open it for you guys. I have not opened it. I decided I would open it on camera for you completely, so I covered up my address, but we're going to open it up. So give me a second to do that. I got my scissors right here. Okay, so we got it opened. Today it is the Unbasic Basics. Here's the bag. The bag says this is not just a lipstick. Again, I don't really use these bags, but they're cute. I would rather it just be in the box. Let's open it up. Let's dig inside and see what we got. Ooh. We got a clear brow gel. And that is from oh, Anastasia Beverly Hills. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. So let's open that up. I don't have anything by Anastasia Beverly Hills. Oh, I'm so excited. That's amazing. That's absolutely amazing. Living Proof Perfect Hair Day Nightcap Overnight Perfector. Apply to damp or dry hair before bed from roots to ends, comb through, leave in or wash out in the morning. Fast absorbing and pillow safe. I might actually use this now that I have short hair. It's a nice size sample though, that's a really big sample. Dr. Jart Water Drop Hydrating Moisturizer. Instant burst of hydration for dry skin. Brightens dull, lackluster skin, long lasting moisturization. I'm probably going to pass this on to somebody else because um, right now I'm trying an entire acne skincare line and I don't know, I just, I don't, I don't know, I might keep it on the back burner, but I'm probably going to put it off um, and give it to someone else, but that's really cool that it's like a really nice size of the Dr. Jart. Here's a box. Okay, what's this? It's a lipstick! Sephora Rouge Brilliance Rouge Shine. Open up. I love little boxes. Okay. Let's see. So it says Sephora on the bottom. You can't. Even, you can even see Sephora, and it doesn't say the color. I'll probably have to look it up. Oh wait, this, huh? Number fourteen, I guess. It's like this pretty light pink color. Let me. That's nice. It's not my favorite, but it's nice, and I'm glad to have it. I'm glad to try it. <clears throat> oh my gosh. Kat Von D Tattoo Liner. And this is in Trooper. Waterproof Liquid Eyeliner. I am so ecstatic to have this. Oh, yes. I am really excited about this. Okay, let's try it. Let's try it. Let's try it. Oh my gosh. Sorry, I got overboard. That's amazing. I've been wanting to try this for a while, but I didn't want to commit to a full size and if I didn't like it. So that's really cool that now I can try it and see if I like it for long term. That's amazing. That's really, 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 ooh, does it want to come off? These two things right here are enough for me for this month, but there's still something else I think. I think it's the perfume sample. Yep, the perfume sample is from Tori Birch, I think that's how you say that, Tori Birch. Introducing Jolie Fleur Verte, a tomboy and easygoing mix. Okay, let's let's give it a smell. I like it. It's very fancy. I really like it. It's a nice, it's a nice scent. I love the perfume samples as usual. Okay, so let's read up in the box or in the bag and see the pun game. They just, the box step up every single month for me, and I think they get better and better. For the pink, we have a little pink me up, which I, eh. <laughs> oh, it's Love Spell. The name of the shade is um, Love Spell. That's really cool. Deep Glossy Shine meets a go-to shade of pink in this creamy moisturizing lipstick. Cool, that's nice. Uh, style You Were Sleeping. I see what they're trying to do, but I don't like it. 
There's one at the top that is a true work of arch. I like that. All Fleur the Best. I like that too. Drop It Bright Now. That's, that's the moisturizer from Dr. Brandt. I actually really enjoy that. And Ink About It is the Kat Von D liner, which is pretty good. So all in all, pretty good, pretty good pun game. There's all the, the pictures of all the stuff. I really like it. Let's let's rate stuff from my least to favorite in this box. So my least favorite would be probably this because I'm not sure if I'll end up using it. But again, everything's a good box this time. Then the hair stuff. Next would be the Sephora lipstick. Then would be the brow stuff. And then my favorite thing is the liner. I cannot wait to try this liner. I, I'm, I'm so ecstatic about this. Oh, you can't even see it. I'm so ecstatic about this liner, guys. This is amazing. So again, totally worth it to me for just these two items right here. But I think this is a great box where there's nothing in it that I'm like not excited about. Even this stuff, if I weren't using like a program right now, I'd be really excited about this. But, you know, I, I can't use it until at least like, I don't know, October 14th or 15th or something. But I'm still, this is really nice. And, you know, I can swap it for something really good in one of my swap groups. Um, the perfume I really like too, but since it's always in there, I'm not going to put it in my least of favorites. But I'm really excited about this, so yeah. There's all the stuff we received this month. I, again, think it's a great box. I like it so much. I'm so glad I switched. I literally love their boxes. There hasn't been one that I've been disappointed in, I don't think. I'm pretty sure there hasn't been one I've been disappointed in. I think it's really nice, especially when you're throwing in stuff from such, like, nice, high-end brands. I mean, I'm really, really excited about these. These are phenomenal. So thank you so, so much for watching, and, um, I can't wait to let you know if I ended up liking these products or not. You may see them in a awesome and awesome. You may see them in a this is crap. You may see them in a monthly favorites. You never know. Or in empties. Okay, so thank you so much for watching, guys. And this is Megan Hilt out.